Hello, everyone, and thanks for joining us. Brooklyn Park's ambitious solar energy plan is underway. The city has begun installing panels on selected buildings. As Eric Nelson reports, it is the largest solar project ever done by a Minnesota city. There's no physical intrusions into the roof. It's time for a panel discussion. No cost to Brooklyn Park up front. Solar panels, that is. Our solar journey has been over a year in the making. Multiple meetings with the council, public meeting for our residents to see what we're looking at, and it culminated just this fall. Brooklyn Park is taking the solar plunge. The city has put up panels at the main fire station. We expect these panels to save up to $1,000 in electrical costs at our fire station here um, in a 12-month period. In a few weeks, these glass rectangles will start generating clean energy as Brooklyn Park begins the solar era. The great thing is when you look behind us, you don't see any smokestacks, you don't see trucks hauling in coal, you don't see any nuclear powered facilities, it's using the sun. Here at the fire station there are 124 panels up on the roof and they will be used to power 80% of this building. Cedar Creek Energy is putting in the solar panels, which are designed to work in any kind of weather conditions. Think of a solar power calculator. Um, they still work in your household. They get some ambient solar light. Same thing with this. They're generating power even on cloudy days, just that they're at peak power on a nice bright sunshiny day. State grant money has made this program possible. And going solar is expected to save Brooklyn Park a minimum of $60,000 after one full year of production. The grant money goes right towards the capital cost of the solar facilities and we get a, you know, a nominal reduction in our energy cost, up to $1,000 savings just in this building. Solar power is also efficient. There is no wasted energy. The way that this is set up, the power that these panels collect feeds right into the fire station and it's used as it's generated. In Brooklyn Park, I'm Eric Nelson, CCX News. The other places in Brooklyn Park getting solar panels are the Police Department, Community Activity Center, Water Treatment Plant, and three buildings at the Operations and Maintenance Facility.